Michigan, but the sun is not that warm. But for the country I'm in, it's still very nice. <laughs> I'm in England, to be specific, in Margate, so at the very south of England. And we're here. I'm here with Nata <laughs> because she is um, taking part at a pole dance competition. We're very excited and yeah. I'm just gonna show you around a bit here in Margaret. It's a very cute tiny village and I hope you can hear me because it's very windy. And yeah, enjoy this trip with us. <laughs> the bar this must be the tiniest bar I've ever seen guck mal ich stehe allein hier drin das ist schon voll I think we didn't even say which competition or what kind of competition listen is taking Participating at taking competition. <laughs> so the competition is called Dance Filthy. Dance Filthy. It's a 
pole dance competition. I think you already said that. Um, oh, maybe this one is making the noise. <laughs> no! There's one traffic light thing that makes a funny noise. It's so weird that it's just like one of them. Yeah, That's just one! <laughs> we will find it. I will find you. I will! What? This is a noise coming. Man. I found him! Oh yeah! What? <laughs> so there will be pole dancers. It will get very naughty and dirty. And I don't know if I'm prepared for this. <laughs> but yeah, I think it's gonna be funny. And they're all very friendly people, as I've been told. Like, oh, I will be in England and I like your pole dancing and let's meet up. Yes! <laughs> This one! <laughs> it's so stupid! Why is it only one like this? I don't know! <laughs> they were like, when they were buying traffic lights for the city, they were like, I mean, one. Like, one. <laughs> That's different. <laughs> Just to mess with people. <laughs> and yeah! If you want to see this, you should continue watching. But if you think this is inappropriate or something then you should open your mind dumbass because it's a very very interesting and very hard sport I mean you have to be able to use every single muscle of your body and that's why I can't do it and I'm too fat for it but yeah oh there's a sign it will take place here tonight Especially in Germany from what I hear and people I talk to is that she's getting ready for the nights of nights the night of nights Can't you see? That's a nice school musical. Oh my god. I admit it. Okay, um and many people still think that it's just naughty and that you just do pole dancing to get attention from men and that you have a bad childhood that's why you drifted up I've actually seen an article not too long ago where it says pole dancing is anti-feministic it's like like you can't pole dance and be a feminist because it's just like doing it to please men that was the argument of the That's thing. so stupid. That's so stupid. I mean... Well, first and foremost, it's a sport. It's yeah. athletic. But I, I do understand that people think that it's just sexual pleasure kind of dancing. But, I mean, nowadays, it's... And it always had been a real sport. Second. Do you have to wear high heels? Why do you have to, you know, undress, do it in like sexy, skimpy clothes? Because there is exotic pole dance, obviously. That's yeah, but there's also exotic dancing where you just wear high heels and like just yeah, a but 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 my bra. Point is, my point is, even this type of exotic pole dancing, it's a type that I do. It's also not anti-feminist. Yeah. It's it's not, you know, the event where I'm going tonight. There are no 
like groups of men allowed to come in there. It's just like for the pole dance community. And I think it's actually like a good way to get in touch with your own, like with your body, with your sexuality, I would say. And it's a very positive thing because women are kind of forced to, you know, like shamed for being openly sexual, mm -hmm. which is a bad thing, yeah. I think. And it's just a cool way to be confident in you with your body, with your sexuality, be in touch with yourself. Yeah. Yeah. You, you do you understand? <laughs> do you understand? Open your mind. And if you just think of it physically, that it's so hard and difficult. I mean, have you tried it once when Neta and I were still living together in an apartment? She had her own pole in her room and sometimes when I was home alone nobody was there I tried to climb up this freaking pole and Jesus <laughs> I mean I am not really athletic or trained in any kind of way but you have to imagine how hard and difficult this kind of sport actually is and that it's not just for gaining attention and being just I don't know you know what I mean I think you get what we're talking about and about this just wearing high heels and not wearing so many clothes at all what's wrong about it when you go swimming a bikini is not more than what you wear when you're doing pole dance and if you have a lot of clothes on dancing on a pole it's very difficult because then you don't have that kind of grip that you need to hold the pole as you have to for not falling down but i think i hope you understand the statement of this and now enjoy the filthy dance competition <laughs> Bottle after bottle, so let me go sit there. 
dann. Also ein bisschen intimidating. Ja. Aber, Aber die sind alle voll auf dich abgegangen. 